All right. Well, welcome. Good job for joining. I know it's uh, getting to summertime and everyone's schedules are going to start filling up, but uh, it's so important to stay engaged in your business and um, working on it and learning at all times. So I know that training is definitely not like the most fun thing to do, but it is so necessary. And the fun part is when your business grows or you start making more money because of that time you've put into those disciplined actions. I don't know if you guys have been on with us before or you're newer to the call. Uh, I kind of opened these up to all representatives and uh, I enjoy teaching. I have a marketing background, so um, being able to implement that in the Avon business, um, it's just really exciting. I'm always trying new different things and uh, you know, the big numbers started very small with lots of failures uh, before having any success. So uh, just keep with it. The important part is to make sure that you're always passionate and you're sharing your excitement and that you are growing over your own performance. Uh, I know that we tend to compare ourselves to others. And I think that's um, getting even worse in our social media applications. But uh, it's just so important to stay focused on growth, personal growth, and being a better you. Uh, so the call is a, a lot more fun now that I have a co-host, Ms. Cheryl Papayan. Um, I am grateful that she joins and helps me with these. It's always more fun to do this stuff with a friend. So if you haven't started uh, building your team yet, I highly recommend it. Um, it's just so much more fulfilling when you have someone to share it with and you can exchange ideas, hold each other accountable. Um, so don't be afraid to put yourself out there. Most of my training is now on YouTube, so uh, please subscribe there. And if you can, uh, if you're not able to make one of our calls, uh, I pretty much upload everything to my YouTube channel. So I just came out with four new videos the other day, and uh, I didn't listen to any of them until the very end and my microphone wasn't plugged in all the way and I had to redo all of them. So <laughs> learn a lesson from me to do a little sound check before you uh, do multiple videos. All right, so we just wrapped up campaign 11. We had 105,270 in team sales, um, which put us number 23. That should be for campaign 11. Um, so overall, we are in the top 25 in the nation. We've already surpassed 1 million for the year and going for a $4 million sales goal. Um, and I had to implement <laughs> this little saying here. Um, yes, their grass is greener and you spend so much time gawking at it. You've got no time to water your own. Um, so if you're newer to the Avon world, there is a little bit of drama that goes around. Um, and what I found is that it's best to stay focused. Uh, if you sit there and complain about something that's bothering you, it's just going to make you more irritated. So um, find solutions to, to problems and don't try to fix everyone else's problems. Stay focused on growing your business because your business is going to go whichever way you are focused. So if you're complaining and talking down about it all the time, your numbers are probably going to go down. 
if you're excited and sharing and happy about it, that's going to attract people to you and you won't even have to feel like you're, you're pushing a sale at all. Um, so fall in love with the process of becoming the very best version of yourself. So I'd like to share what's going on in my little world. Uh, I, I went into the store and uh, visited Avon Social, printed out a bunch of uh, branded photos and got some cheap <laughs> acrylic frames from Walmart. I think they were like $2 a piece. Um, printed out all these nice photos got some decorations at the Dollar Tree, and really just made this display look so much better. Um, so I just wanted to share how you can really like make something look great without having to spend a lot of money. Um, ever since I did that display, our, our sales have been up. Um, so if you're a new representative, don't feel like you have to have a ton of product to get going and set up your first table event. Um, especially during the summer, I say that maybe you just do bug guard. Um, make sure that you have that on hand um, and focus on looking professional, not, not feeling like you have to do it perfect just to do it your first time. Um, here's my little kiddos in the backyard. I'm glad I snapped that picture because the trees are already like not many flowers on them anymore. So enjoy the weather and uh, summer will be here soon. We keep swinging back from like 50 to 80. So <laughs> hopefully it'll uh, stable out. This is my mom and my sisters. Uh, had a Mother's Day gathering with them and my oldest sister just bought a boutique so it runs in the family. Um, Christina, this is, uh, I have an Avon retail store so that's at the store. Um, I always fit time for our date nights. I always uh, try to go for balance in my life and uh, that's when I seem the happiest, when I'm engaged in all the different relationships in my life, when I have a balance between work and home life. Um, and here's two of my employees. We always get together to brainstorm and see what could we do, be doing better? What could we be doing differently? So um, find those key partners in your life and your work that you can really talk to and come up with some great ideas for. Uh, becoming a successful rep a lot of times is just about trying a lot of different things. Uh, Cheryl shared how she has some influencers. Uh, I tried the same thing and none of my family have shared anything. <laughs> so, um, you know, if something's working for someone else and it's not for you, uh, you know, maybe it's just not going to work in your business. So keep trying new things until you have a full schedule of activities that um, produce results. So campaign 13, we can submit our order at any time during this two week time period. So we have May 29th through June 11th. Our website switches over the day before. And then on the campaign close day, we always have our campaign insider on the Avon representative uh, USA Facebook page. So make sure you get on there, um, learn from Michael Sengstack and, and uh, engage with your fellow representatives. And then looking ahead, we have campaign 14. And uh, I did wanna mention, when we get to campaign 15 and you can buy the sale books, uh, we can get them a little bit earlier in leadership, uh, but I expect this to be a, a really great successful campaign because whenever it says sale, <laughs> our customers spend a lot of money. So maybe you wanna take advantage of that 
and buy extra books when campaign 15 comes around. Uh, we have a lot of specials on skincare coming up in campaign 13. Um, so order early in the campaign, especially if it's holiday stuff, you guys, um, and maybe give that warning that this is limited supply. I will let you know if there's any issues when I go to place your order. And the sooner you place it during that two week time frame, the more likely you're going to be able to get all of your products. You can no longer return outlet items. So I pass that on to my customer and let them know that um, because I don't want to be stuck with the product if they decided they didn't like it. Um, so a lot of times uh, providing good customer service and preventing your customer from getting frustrated is about setting the expectation and uh, giving them all of the information up front. So you can, does, any, does anybody know on the outlet items if if an item is broke, can you return it? I honestly don't know. If you know, just type it in the in the chat, please. Okay. Um, so keep some products on hand. Uh, if you're doing a table, some of the good things to have are lip balms and hand creams and deodorants. And uh, like I said, the, the Skin So Soft Bug Guard as well as our traditional Skin So Soft products. Glimmer sticks. Yes, glimmer sticks too, for sure. Um, and, and think about collecting contact information more than about how many sales can you get that day. I mean, of course, you're going to take the sales. So if you have good sales, that's great. Um, but also think about that future value of being able to market to those customers. Maybe you'll follow up with one of them and they'll book a fundraiser for you. So. Um, you just never know what's going to come from a relationship with a customer or a lead. So you want to be continuously communicating with them uh, until they're ready to take action. We have Father's Day coming up. So maybe you want to make up some gift sets. Maybe you have some sets of True Gent and the Mesmerize car. Um, I know we've sold a couple of those already. So look ahead and prepare for holidays um, and focus on a few products each campaign. So get to know your products slowly and don't be afraid to look information up if your customer has any questions. Yeah, um, like this, this campaign I'm focusing on the True Gent the car, the mesmerized car, bug guard, and the vitamin C. That sounds like really good choices. Thank you. <laughs> so you do want to have samples and demos on hand. Um, and sometimes it's more cost efficient to buy the full bottle and be creative with your sampling. Uh, so share everywhere you physically go and on all of your online channels. So um, try to work those together. So if you're, you know, going out and you're going to drop off some books, take a picture and show yourself with the book and post on Facebook and say, does anyone want uh, our most recent catalog? So, um, you can try to work it into your life instead of, okay, I'm going to sit down and do my social media now. Um, so you can, you can really do it either way. You can sit down and have focus sessions where you just bang out a bunch of online marketing, um, or you can work it into your day and share it more as you incorporate Avon into your everyday life. Um, so how can we reach the most people? Again, about promoting the website on the books, sharing your website everywhere online, and always adding new team members. 
So learning from Avon University, your peers, and then again, uh, most of my content now is going to be on YouTube and I do shoot that out through emails. So um, take information from everywhere around you and uh, incorporate all the positive stuff. Leave the negative stuff behind. <laughs> I always said, you know, I, I used to be on Facebook and I would like be on there all day long and I'd try to answer people's questions and be so involved and engaged everywhere. And when it came down to it, I wasn't growing my own business doing that. So um, make sure that the time that you are spending on your Avon business is productive and is producing results. Do you feel personal cards help promote the site? Um, as far as like a greeting card? I, I know a lot, a lot of people like to send out thank you cards uh, when somebody places an order, but I'm not sure what she's referring to either. Um, I did. I did used to send the book as a thank you, um, and it, it just became too costly. So I think you really have to weigh uh, the benefit versus the cost of the marketing activities that you put into the business. Hi, Becky. Uh, and it, it's great to say thank you. So if you, if you have a smaller customer base and you're looking to grow, um, take really good care of that customer base that you have, thanking them and providing them great service. Um, and they will start hopefully referring their friends and family to you. The business card. So I, I like the idea of leaving your business cards around town more than the brochure. I really don't like the idea of leaving brochures when I don't know that someone wants it. So I feel like it's more cost effective to leave business cards. Um, and you can even order on, on town and country. I think you can order like the, the card that has the welcome 10 code. Is that mm -hmm. right, Cheryl? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So I would, I would do that over books if I was just going to be, passing them out. And then you could, you know, if someone contacts you, then you can give them a book. But I mean, everyone likes to do it differently. So if you're in it, if you're leaving it like at a, a nail salon or somewhere where there's a waiting area, I like the idea of leaving the book. Or like Cheryl has a Mexican restaurant where they let her leave books there for people to take. So I think it all depends on the situation. But um, business cards are, are a lot more cost effective than a full brochure. I actually um, got a box of the Bug Guard business cards from Town and Country. I don't know if I earned them or if I ordered them. But anyway, so um, one day soon, I'm going to have my husband, Buddy, help me. And we're going to go to like the Walmart parking lot and just slide them in everybody's window. Oh, that's <laughs> a good idea. Yeah, because I'm not really handing the business cards out like I need to be. But I thought if I just put them on everybody's window, it'll jog their memory. Oh, I need bug guard. I like it. <laughs> and if I was going to go around in the neighborhood, I would get the... The plastic bags so that you don't have to like skip the houses that don't have a newspaper slot <laughs> right uh, okay so we do have a couple of new customer sets for new representatives that's starting in campaign 13 so if you are in your kickstart program, campaign 12 is your last chance to get those daily care collections. Um, so really try to hit your kickstart goals if you're just starting out with us. Um, it's where you're gonna make the most money. Uh, it's, it'll make a huge difference getting that 40%. So 
um, just really push yourself and share as much as you can in as many different ways as you can. Um, and that will really build your excitement and make the people around you excited as well. We do have a new representative webinar once a month. So if you are on my team, you'll receive a separate, separate invite for that. So here's the new sets and this launches in campaign 13 and takes the place of the daily care collection. Um, so this flyer, I found the link through our beauty buzz. Um, see what I mean, Cheryl, like how that writing's really kind of hard to read. Um, yeah. So I, Cheryl and I talked about how we were going to maybe just take some of the images and make our own flyer because uh, the shape of this flyer is, is not eight and a half by 11. And we just want to make it easy for our representatives to be able to print it off and order them. So um, these are awesome sets. Can't miss faves. It's 50 bucks and the, it's $124 value. They can sell it to their face-to-face -face customers as well as their online customers. So um, if you're newer to shopping on your website, there is a way to enter by product number. Um, and then this set is 25 and you get three products. All right, so congratulations to some of our newest top sellers. We have Sharice, Laura, Deanna, Debbie, Shelly, Elizabeth, Maria, Kiana, Martha, Patricia, and Colleen. Way hey, to go. Some of those are on my team. Way to go. Um, I really stress to try and get a four to $600 order every campaign. Um, that's going to set you up for President's Club and it's going to set you up to earn Jamaica. So um, really push yourself. And like I said, always be learning. Um, Avon has information out there for us like everywhere. <laughs> so, you know, maybe you want to make a checklist. Uh, did I read the beauty buzz this week? Check. Did I watch the campaign insider? Check. Um, you know, is there a course in Avon U that I need to take? Um, and then also make sure that your preferences are set so that you're hearing from Avon corporate. and leveraging those business tools so we can also uh, look at our what's new books. There's a lot of helpful tips in there. Um, and then also looking at the brochure before it launches to see what sort of plan we want to come up with, what we want to focus on. And, you know, maybe there's a few hot deals that you want to point out to your customers. Yeah, they have the, um, what's that called? There's a couple of products in each campaign and it'll, it's a hot deal. And yeah. you can go through your brochure and put, you know, when a little sticky note for your customers, not for every brochure that you hang out, um, but just for the customers that you're giving and giving them to so they can just go right to that page. Well. Karen, uh, she's saying that she's lucky to get 40. I, I totally get that. I, for a year, like barely ever had any orders. Um, so it does, it, it does take a while. And, you know, some people get off to an amazing start and some people have a harder time. I think the um, the main point is to just keep trying different things until you find something that you really enjoy doing. So maybe that's home parties, maybe that's setting up at festivals, however you really like selling and interacting with people, that's the way I feel you should go. <laughs> Okay, so Rep Fest, yay, August 2nd through the 4th. 
Um, it's going to be so exciting. And to track for the President's Club, we want to get 10,000 in award sales for the whole cycle. But if you can get, get it before Rep Fest, you get to go to the Beauty Bash on the Bayou. So um, we don't know exactly what that is yet, but I'm guessing like live music and drinks and food and um, fun. So uh, really push, try and get on pr to President's Club. Um, and if you're tracking, if you're around 4,200 for the year right now, um, that's where you would be if you're doing that 385 every single campaign. So we have uh, almost 60 team members signed up. Um, here's our small little intimate group the first year, and then it gets bigger and it keeps getting bigger. So. Um, you guys just think about it that way, like really take care of your groups of people that you service with your Avon business, whether that's your customers, your online customers, or your team members. Um, just do it the way that you would want to be treated yourself. And um, when you take care of the people right around you, it starts to grow and it really starts to compound on top of each other. So um, try not to get discouraged and stay optimistic and stay trying new things until you get your flow. Um, so we made some little collages here. Super excited to see many of you for uh, the second or third time and excited to meet some of the newer faces as well. So if you haven't signed up for Rep Fest yet, um, I really push you guys to do it. I remember the first conference I signed up for. I had every excuse in the book, like why I couldn't afford it, why I shouldn't go. <laughs> um, and I just did it. Um, you know, you have, to, you have to take those courageous, bold moves to be able to um, grow personally. So commit to Rep Fest and figure out how you're going to um, how you're going to afford it and how you're going to make it totally worth it to bring back to your Avon business. What was your first one? It was one of the ones, it was Orlando. Was that the one that you wanted me to go to four years ago? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> I was just wondering how long you've been going to them. Were you on my team? Were you on my team when I had the brain surgery? No. Okay. It was that. It was that same year. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, I was even crazy enough to go after surgery. <laughs> it was my first. I should say it was my first leadership conference. That was like really when I started getting more involved with leadership. Yeah. Um, so here are some of Team Momentum's top sellers that are already well on their way. Miss Cheryl, you made President's Club. Way to go. Look at Wendy. Wow. Wow. I know. Anne, Peter, and Wendy. Those are awesome numbers. Um, keep going, you guys. I know those numbers look big when you're not doing them yourself, but it really comes from all those disciplined actions and uh, it, it does take time. So be patient. Um, so you can track your own President's Club numbers by going under rewards and recognition um, and find that PRP tracker. And yay, I'm excited. We are building a, a retreat around the making strides of Rockford. Uh, so anyone on Team Momentum can come. You have to be a bronze ambassador or higher or President's Club or higher by September 30th. Um, I will cover your, hotel, your accommodations. 
you guys got to pay to get here. So um, I love the idea of having team members come to my hometown. You guys can see my Avon store, meet my family, uh, and just the opportunity for all of us to network together as some of the top sellers and top leaders um, is pretty cool. And RepFest is, is so busy that sometimes there's not enough time to interact with your own team. So um, just kind of setting the expectation there. It's a little bit hectic, but it's um, awesome energy and you definitely should go. Um, I can't wait. What? I can't wait. I know, New Orleans, here we come. Um, and we are going to do the Making Strides Walk. So last year, Avon became the first national presenting sponsor of the American Cancer Society walks all over the United States. Um, there are a ton of them. So uh, definitely walk in your local one. Those of you that are coming to Rockford, we'll all do it together so we can um, network and learn from each other and give money back for breast cancer. So how exciting. And let's congratulate our top sellers. We have Ann, Leisha, Wendy, Cheryl, May, Dorothea, Jillian, Trisha, Gloria, Margaret, Elizabeth, Terry, Melissa, Melissa, Christopher, Beverly, Becky, Luann, Haiti, and Doris. Woohoo! Way to go! Yay! Um, let's see, Beth, you can find who your leader is under your account and your profile, I believe. It says um, mentor and it should have your leader's name and contact information. Yes, Wanda, I will definitely be doing something with the team. Um, I don't know that, are there like times and stuff posted yet, Cheryl? For RepFest? Yeah. I don't, I looked um, yesterday or the day before and I didn't see anything. Okay. Yeah, we will definitely be having some sort of event for Team Momentum. I don't know what that is yet, but um, pencil man. <laughs> we'll figure something out. Okay, so product focus and launches. Uh, so something that, uh, you know, Cheryl and I have been incorporating since we went to the leadership conference in January is, is doing more of our own product pictures and our own pictures of us wearing the jewelry or the clothing. Um, and what I think Cheryl and I are both finding is that we get better results when they're actually real photos that we've taken ourselves. Um, I think it just comes off more real instead of like an advertisement. So. Um, people kind of glaze over at ads because we just see so many. So when they see like a picture of our vitamin C products, like in someone's bathroom, um, you know, that, that gains more attention. And I am getting more, more likes, more reaches with those kind of posts. So um, I know that there are a lot of products that come out and especially in the beginning, you may not be able to afford them all, um, but have fun with it. And if you can buy demos, uh, take photos with them, do videos, use them as testers, like really get your money's worth. <laughs> and uh, with the bug guard, I have a video on that because um, there's differences between the product lines. So having knowledge about those bug guard products uh, will really help you sell them this summer. Uh, anytime someone brings up a graduation party or a, a birthday party, sports, picnics, uh, make sure you have some bug guard flyers. Better yet, have some on hand. Uh, Cheryl shared how she has the individual packets 
and then has her contact information on it. Um, like what a nice gesture to see someone like whapping at mosquitoes. Oh, here, try one of my Skin So Soft Bug Guard towels. Uh, and then maybe you just made a new customer. Um, so what I have found with especially some of my friends and, and family that maybe hadn't tried Avon for years or decades. <laughs> it's like if I give them a product and they try it, they love it and they keep coming back to me. So sometimes it's about getting them to try our products again or for the first time so they can see what great quality they are. Um, so looking ahead at events, being prepared for that. Uh, if you want to sell more, sometimes you have to invest more. So that means more books, uh, scheduling events, promote fundraising, wear your Avon shirt or a name tag or a button. Um, you can be really creative, but always be representing our company so that if someone asks you, you're prepared and you have a book for them. Uh, so here's the different channels for Avon Corporate and then my social media profiles and sharing excitement. So going into Avon Social and looking at the different product posts, um, it's okay if you can't afford the products and you can't take your own pictures. Um, Avon Social has a ton of content in there and uh, pictures and uh, wording to go along with it. So make sure that you are consistent online um, and persistent. You have to be both to get any results. <laughs> um, follow Avon on their social media channels. That might spark an idea for you. Look at our own website. Um, if I'm feeling like not creative and, and need a little help with what I want to write, I'll go to the website or, or page through the book and look for ideas there. We have a shareable video gallery, and then we also have all of our fun incentives. So ways that we can connect digitally, uh, Facebook, Zoom, live video, Snapchat, Instagram, and YouTube. Um, and then just some ideas down here of how you can kind of do different themes when you're taking pictures or doing your videos. So you do get paid uh, two days after the order ships, you get the commission for the online sale. So once you have a $5 credit, that will initiate and go into your direct deposit. Make sure you have that set up under my account and get paid by Avon. So congrats to our e-sellers. We have Ann, Wendy, Wanda, Jillian, Beverly, Christopher, Rosa, Melissa, Graciela, and Shavonda. Congratulations. Way to go, you guys. Hopefully you shared the free shipping yesterday. Um, and a few of us are off to Los Cabos in just over a week. Um, super excited, Becky and Cheryl and Bridget and Melissa and I are all going to be going. Um, and I know I tell you guys to follow the people that are making it happen. Um, so look at who I take pictures with and look who Cheryl takes pictures with and become friends with them. <laughs> Um, the people that are going on these trips and achieving, um, that's who you want to surround yourself with uh, so that it starts rubbing off on you. So you say, oh, you know, she is so good at that. Now I see why she sells so much of the Magic's Foundation <laughs> or whatever it is. So just follow the people in the crowd that you want to become. So you want to become a top seller, you follow top sellers. You want to become a top leader, um, you get to know the top leaders.
So we have lots of achie achievers in our twice as nice incentive with the selfie light and the t-shirt. Congratulations, you guys. Way to go. Woohoo! Always fun to earn business tools. I know I don't really like to spend money on business tools, so if you can get them for free, do it. <laughs> okay, I'm handing it over to Miss Cheryl. Oh, that was quick. Hi, everybody. <laughs> so we are going to be, are we talking first about campaign 13? Skincare that's anything but routine. That's my favorite right there, the Anu Ultimates, the best, best line that we have. Okay, I'm ready. New slide. Okay, so um, in your campaign 13, what's new? I brought mine with me. I'm actually working out of town. Um, you'll notice that with all of the uh, new products, the majority of them, you're gonna get a free eye system if you purchase two of the products. So if you purchase two of the um, ultimate products, you're gonna get the free um, eye system and it tells you on pages two to four. And then on the next page, same, same thing. If you order the um, two ultimate purchases, you get the ultimate eye system. Hydrofusion, if you order two Hydrofusion products, you're gonna get the free eye serum and it goes on and on through the, um, the different, you know, the reversalist and the, um, the platinum. So you, if you have, you know, regular skincare customers that, that are always buying skincare, make sure that you let them know about this great deal because those, um, the eye systems, they run like around $28 or something like that. So it's a really great deal. If they're gonna buy the two products, you, they might as well get the free eye system with it. So yeah. Yes, the Anu is awesome. And I love this. I love the hair, the hair fragrance. I'm hoping that it turns out to be a hot seller so that Avon does more of it in some of the other scents. Um, there's nothing better than, you know, you're close to somebody and you can actually smell their hair. Like if somebody uses like a really good hairspray or shampoo and conditioner, I love when hair smells good. Um, and then of course we also have the, um, the candles that are coming out, our summer candles. And the What's New, you can get four candles for $38.97. If you're President's Club, it's $36.37. But we've got Coastal Lilies, Watermelon Margarita, Flamingo Island, Beach Day, Coconut Cove, and Waffle Cone. So what you could do is you can, you know, set up a really pretty setting, maybe um, bubbles in the bathtub with a lit candle, take a picture and share it on social media. You don't gotta be in the bathtub, okay? But when people see those types of pictures versus just a, you know, a standard picture of a candle. Okay, so here we have a picture of a candle. Big deal, it's not going to attract any attention, seriously. But if somebody's scrolling through their newsfeed and they see this beautiful picture of maybe, you know, a candle in the living room and, and a nice meal or whatever the case might be, when they see something like that, they're going to stop and look at it. So keep that in mind. You don't have to be in a photo, but you want to give them um, just a sense of reality instead of just a picture. Because you know what? I scroll through that stuff. Most of us do. But when I see something, a picture that my friend actually took or a family member, I'm going to stop and look. So be creative. Creativity. And then in campaign 14, it's really exciting because it's all about the glow. So we're going to have our, um, You've got the Radiant Glow Skin Luminosity Polish. And let me tell you guys, I'll just give you a little laugh for the night. When I first got this, I thought it was a body butter because it came in the same um, container that our body butter comes in. And I'm putting that stuff on me, trying to figure out why it's all grainy. And then when it was all done, I felt like I was covered in sand because it's a polish they use in the shower. 
So don't use it as lotion, you guys. But we have the dry oil mist, the dazzle drops. Our dazzle drops are really popular. I mean, really popular. You can use the, um, the oil mist on your arms in the summertime when you're going to a barbecue. And it just gives you this high, um, just this glittery scent. It's not like overdoing it. Um, you can put as little as you want on or as more as, as more as you would like. We've got the bronzing pearls. I mean, it's all about um, glowing for the holiday or for the summer season. Uh, yeah, so you've got your, oh, what's it called? Let me go back. The illuminating stick, the illuminating stick, you can actually use it as eyeshadow. I saw Janine do that. She said that sometimes when she's in a hurry, she just uses it as eyeshadow. And if you, if you use this stuff when you're delivering your customer's orders, they might be like, oh, why is, your, why is your shoulder so shimmery? And then you can tell them and show them, hey, you know, this is the product that I'm using. And that's how you demo products. You, you share it, you wear it, you share it, and then you sell it. What else do we got? Oh, we have some new products coming. Um, I like this, the two-in-one lip tattoo. I cannot wait to give that a try. I love that Avon is um, really getting into these new trends with, um, with beauty and the younger crowd and everything. I think these are gonna do really well. So I'm excited to give them a try. Anything that keeps the, the color on my lips, I'm happy. And then of course we have lots of jewelry coming up, lots of new fashion. So now we're going to, I think it is the same as a lip stain. So now we're getting into our um, incentives. We have the new incentive, the win-win incentive. I'm really excited about this one. If you are in leadership, um, this incentive is for you. And this is going to put a lot more money in your pocket. This runs from campaign 13 to 18. That's going to be May 29th all the way through August 20. It's for leadership, and you can earn, um, when you sign somebody up, any of your new representatives that, that place their first order at any time from campaign 13 to campaign 18, you have a goal to make. So if you're a promoter to gold ambassador, you have to have, oh, that's small, $500 total sales of your brand new reps who place orders within this time frame. And then if you're um, bronze to silver leaders, your goal is 1,000 gold leaders, 2,000 executive leaders, and above 4,000. And this is based on how you performed in campaign 11. So in campaign 11, I was performing at bronze leader. So my goal is for my brand new um, representatives that place their first order anytime after campaign 13, all the way through campaign 18, their accumulative sales for me need to be $1,000. And then when they are, I'm going to earn an additional 5% on their orders. So normally, um, let's say I'm performing at Gold Leader, my percentage would be 8%, plus I also get a 3% sponsoring bonus on those representatives. And now with this incentive, as long as I meet my goal, I'm gonna get another 5% on top of that. And then if they're online orders, I get an another 5% on top of that. I mean, think about that. That's eight, 11, that's 21%. Wow, I didn't look at it that way. So you can see how much money you can make. And then for every one of them that places a $150 order, first or second order, you get your sponsoring bonus on top of that. So that's another $25. Um, it just keeps adding up is what I'm saying. And in one campaign, two campaigns, think about all the money that you can make. So it's really good to get out there and start, um, start recruiting now so that these new recruits that you have are placing their first orders during the campaigns 13 to 18. Um, and maybe come up with some incentives for your team members that haven't placed their first order 
you know, an incentive, incentivize them placing those orders, especially $150 or more orders. Oh, that was a mouthful. And then of course we have our um, high five online incentive through the end of May. We don't know yet if they're gonna do it again for June, but for every five unique online orders, $50 or more, you're gonna get a $25 bonus and that's unlimited. If you have 20 um, in the month of May unique orders, then that's a $100 bonus. So, oh my gosh, all these incentives, they're so, there's so many and there's so much money out there, you guys. So much money. And then we have the RepFest incentive. So um, decide now if you're going to go to RepFest so that you can actually work on this incentive. Basically, um, you're going to have a sales increase of either $500 or for level two, it's going to be $1,000. And this is from campaign 12 to 15. If you've never been a rep um, to compare it to, it's going to basically be a thousand dollars sales goal for level one and fifteen hundred for level two. And what you can earn is a special Mardi Gras lanyard, a survival pack, a snack pack. Sneak, sneak peek access to the product expo and a chance to win an iPhone X at an exclusive giveaway. Now, if um, the only way that you can earn these products is if you actually attend RepFest. So you might meet all the criteria, but if you don't check in in New Orleans at RepFest, you're not gonna get any of these prizes. So keep that in mind. And you can go to, when you log into Avon now or youravon.com, on your landing page, if you scroll all the way down, you'll see where it says sales incentives. You click on that and it will take you to all the incentives so that you can go in there and go through all of the details and everything so that you know for yourself or for your team exactly what you need to do. And then we have the vitamin C incentive. So basically, this one's even great too. For each region, they're giving away two cruises. There's four regions within Avon, so that's a total of eight cruises. And it's like a sweepstakes, so to get an entry, you have to sell three of the vitamin C serums. This does include the What's New bundles. So for every three vitamin C serums that you sell between April 23rd and June 25th, that's campaigns eight to 14, you're gonna get one entry into the sweepstakes. And basically what you earn is $1,000 to cruise anywhere you want, plus your airfare. Now, I don't think that that is for two people, the airfare, I think it's only for one. Um, but anyway, so they're giving away eight cruises. I'll have to confirm because I've been wondering about, um, I mean, I'm sure they don't expect you to cruise by yourself. So if you can get two cruises for $1,000, $500 each plus airfare, I don't think that it includes the airfare for the second person. So um, I will find that out. But you, again, you can find all the details um, under the incentives on yourayvon.com, sorry. Um, wow, look at all those people. Go back. All these people that have entries into the cruise. You don't have, you don't have to go back. <laughs> wow, that's a lot of people. So I'm hoping that one of us wins, especially me. That would be nice. Okay, so we still have our double dollars online. This is going all the way through August 6, 2019, up through RepFest. So basically, all online orders that you get through that time frame, you're going to get double award sales. You're not going to earn twice as much. You're just going to get double award sales. And award sales are what's used to determine your, um, your sales level, that you, whether it's just a regular rep or a president's club rep or honor society. There's all these different levels. And... 
excuse me, award sales are what's used to determine that level. So online sales, guys, really push your online store so that you can earn President's Club. And if you earn President's Club by Rep Fest, you get to go to the PC Bash, which is gonna be so exciting, I can't wait. And then of course we have our Make It Jamaica. You can read all of the um, details on how to earn this. It's not too complicated. You're gonna have a specific sales goal and you have to have 25% of that in online sales. Or if you're doing it via your team, you'll have team sales at your team sales requirement. And I believe 25% of that has to be in online sales. And then they're coming up with new, there is another way that you can earn it, but I'm not gonna get into all those deets. Um, just go to the sales incentives at youravon.com and read through it so that you understand it. And if you ever have any questions, you can always call Avon for help as well. So you're going to have um, on your main landing page, you, we, there's widgets, what we call widgets. And you can choose what widgets you can see. And some of those widgets are to track your progress. Um, where else can you see that, Emily? Where else can you see the widget? The, your, pro, your progress on the different incentives. Um, just, I mean, I guess it depends. Some of the incentive ones are like on a certain page. You can, you can change the ones on your home page on Avon now. Yeah, and I think I, I've noticed before that if you go to the sales incentives and click on that, some of the incentives that are actually there, there's a place down below to track your progress. So you'll just have to check it out. Yeah, it usually says uh, get details and then it, like that page it takes you to will have the, the pro progress tracker. Yeah, so if, if you're reading, if you're looking at where you're standing right now, what you want to do is you want to figure out at any given time, how many campaigns do I have left to earn this incentive? And then figure out how much do I need? And then divide that, maybe it's 14 campaigns that you have left to earn it, and you need another $10,000. So how many sales do I need each campaign um, for 14 campaigns to earn an incentive? Or whatever the case might be and then pay attention to what that number is and then sit down and have a plan, get a strategy to actually meet those goals every campaign so that you can earn the incentives. Right. Hey, I'm done. Yay, thank you, Cheryl. You're welcome. All right, so building that paycheck is really, uh, you know, how can you really boost your money you're bringing in from the business. My suggestion is to focus on all of the ways that you can earn bonus money um, because that's going to, you know, the other stuff you can slowly build and eventually it'll go up as, as your numbers go up. But the bonus is really where you can give it a, a boost in a short period of time. So, um, when you sign up a new representative and they submit a $150 order in their first or second campaign, you're going to get a $20 qualified new recruit bonus, um, which is really helpful. I usually get like 80 to 120 extra dollars every two weeks just on those qualified new recruit bonuses. Um, you also get 3% on um, anyone that signs up. So the program started last year. So we've uh, been collecting an extra 3% on all of those people um, since then. And then uh, promotion bonuses. So this is where you can make like a really good little chunk of money. <laughs> um, especially on the way to Gold Ambassador because the numbers there aren't too far apart that if you get in the groove and keep bringing people on, um, you can really build to gold ambassador uh, in, a, in a kind of
kind of a shorter period of time. Once you get up to the leader level, it, you know, the, the climb in between becomes a little bit longer. <laughs> so um, just getting excited, bring people in, try to help them and support them. We can't have like full control about what our team members do. So um, some might not work out. Just be ready for that. Um, there's, you know, there's a lot of hard work and effort that goes into leadership. And sometimes you don't see the payoff in those early days until you get up to a higher level. So um, it all does eventually pay off and it is all worth it. So just keep building. Um, know your compensation chart. Uh, this is your requirements for each of those levels. Um, and again, if this is too much for you, I recommend just looking at the title right above wherever you're at. So um, if you've already signed up one team member, look at what you got to do to get to star promoter. That would be two people. Um, and you have to submit a $50 order. Uh, then once you're at star promoter, okay, what more do I need to do to get to bronze ambassador? Well, you need $1,000 as the team. You need three people directly under you to place an order in the same campaign. And you need the $200. So if you take it slowly and one step at a time, it's uh, a lot easier to digest than looking at the bottom and all those huge numbers. So um, just focus on growth and then those incentives and bonuses uh, will come. Again, this is just illustrating, uh, you know, how much money in those bonuses that you can earn on the way to Gold Ambassador. So everyone can sign up new team members. It just changed uh, just recently. So now it's actually, I think it says um, advisor. What, what's your advisor code? <laughs> So that's kind of the wording there, um, but it's still the same process. They can get there from your website um, or you can send them to sellavon.com. You always want to make sure that they have your code so that they are assigned to you. Um, they can also search by your name. So these are the three different sets that are now options for new representatives when they sign up. Uh, so the sign up process just changed. It's now $30 flat um, and they get to pick one of these free gift items. Um, so the one of the other biggest changes to the sign up process is that they're only getting um, two brochures for their first two campaigns. Um, Avon is really um, encouraging that we start sharing more of the electronic brochure, that we share our website. Um, that's the way that society is going. Um, so if we don't start adapting to those good habits, um, we're going to just keep dragging our feet in the mud. So <laughs> um, it's best to really just adapt to change as it comes um, and, and really walk, walk through that with your customers so they feel comfortable um, looking at stuff digitally instead of through the paper catalog. Um, so congratulations to our top five leaders. Cheryl Papayan, Becky Kubacki, I don't know if I'm saying that right at all, Becky, <laughs> Shane Hewitt, Kim Karpowitz, Terry Mosquita, and down at the bottom there with highest reps, Cheryl, Jane, Becky, Kim, and Amy. Congratulations, you guys. We have appointed 93 new beauty bosses in May. So um, keep going. It's fun to build your own team. Um, even if you're not sold on it right now, it might grow on you because uh, it did for me. Same with Cheryl, I think. <laughs>
Um, so surround yourself with people who talk about visions and ideas, not other people. Um, so I guess just in my observations, sometimes I find that Facebook is more about the drama where YouTube is like where people go to learn. <laughs> so maybe I'm way off, but um, stay focused on your business and growth and, and changing people's lives. That's what is important in life. So yes, Instagram is fun. It's life. <laughs> Yes, Instagram, you can't, well, I guess you could still kind of. <laughs> I was muted and I didn't know. <laughs> oh, were you talking? Yeah, I guess I muted myself. <laughs> Oops. No, I was going to say um, there was a little hoopla going in in the chat about um, not learning and this and that. This webinar the webinars that we do are just to give you the gist and the gist of what's going on and to encourage you and to motivate you and, you know, to answer simple questions. I mean, if we sat there and gave in-depth answers to um, all these, you know, questions that we could talk about for an hour, we'd never get through the webinar, but here's the deal. Every single product that we sell, the information about that product is either in the brochure or on your website, or there's, um, there's all kinds of information in Avon University. They have um, uh, different videos about teaching you all about the product. As, as with anything else, it's up to you guys to learn. Um, if you're not taking the time to go into Avon University to learn about the products, if you're not going through your brochure or going online and learning about the different products and what you're selling to your customers, um, I'm, I'm sorry, <laughs> um, but you have to take personal responsibility for yourself and your business. Uh, I don't know how much more I can stress that. Um, we could sit here and talk all night, but until you take that responsibility and take the time and the energy to learn and to um, educate yourself, then you're not going to have the answers for your customers or, or know how to grow your business and everything. So um, I just wanted to share that. There was just a little bit of negativity going on in the chat. So I'm all done. Right. Cool. Thank you. Tough love from Mama Cheryl. <laughs> it is true. A lot of people don't want to take the time to learn. They want to be told exactly what to do. Unfortunately, that doesn't work in our business because mm -hmm. what works for me might not work for Cheryl and vice versa. So um, again, it's about taking the time to, to learn about the different ways and then implementing it and seeing if it works for you. Yeah, I worry. Right. I'm, I'm not well, trying to be, what? to be mean. I'm not trying to be mean or anything. I'm just keeping it real. No, yeah, I saw. Um, yeah, I don't know. We kind of have a structure to the call and that's, that's what we cover. Hopefully we teach something new. Um, and we but, do go, we do go back in after the, the webinar is posted, the replay. And I know Emily goes in there and answers questions and other people do. So we have to keep the webinar rolling. We're on a time frame, but that doesn't mean you're not going to get answers. Okay. Well, thank you guys for joining again. I know it's a busy time and as summer comes, um, you know, you probably aren't going to want to put in the time and the work, but uh, you, you got to do it every day. Keep, keep doing the grind and eventually your progress and your success will start building and you won't have to work as hard anymore someday. <laughs> I'd rather work my Avon business and work my tail off on it than go out in like 110 degree weather any day. <laughs> yes, ma'am. It's too hot. I hear ya. 
All right, you guys. Well, thank you for joining. I will post this on YouTube if you want to catch the replay again. And we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.